Hi, everyone. I'm Vladimir Jutit. We are watching all the news happening in the United States and around the world. You can see them all coming into the newsroom here. If it's happening there, it will be brought to you live right here. This is CBS News 24-7. Breaking this morning, Wall Street Journal reporter Evan Gershkovich sentenced to 16 years in a Russian prison on espionage charges, what we're hearing out of Moscow and from his employer. A global tech outage halts flights and cripples businesses nationwide, what Microsoft and CrowdStrike are saying about the cause. And more senior Democrats are calling for President Biden to step aside in the race for the White House. Who is the latest to speak out against the president's chances at re-election? We're going to tell you. All right, but let's begin with the breaking news. A Russian court has sentenced Wall Street Journal reporter Evan Gershkovich to 16 years in prison on espionage charges. The U.S. government and the Wall Street Journal deny the allegations and have repeatedly denounced the Russian trial as a sham. Let's get straight to CBS News senior foreign correspondent Elizabeth Palmer, who's joining me now to talk about this. So, Liz, uh, were there any surprises in the verdict today? 